exotics and low riders from my house. I dreamed about it. Now all I do walk out my front door and I see I got it. All right, back. Got another clothing and sneaker haul. These are all pickups from February that I'm super excited about. A bunch of good brands. I got stuff from Adidas, sneakers, and clothing. Something from Jordan, something from Top Man, something from Stussy. Got something from Supreme. I got a steel pickup from something at The Gap that was uh, a gem that a lot of people have been asking me about. So, a bunch of good stuff that I'm going to show you in this video. And I do not want to delay this at all. So, let's get into all that right now. First up, let's get into a pair of Adidas Originals and I am super hyped on this sneaker. I needed these and they thankfully sent them over so huge thank you to Adidas for hooking your boy up with these joints because this is a sneaker that I absolutely needed and I'm glad they sent it over to share with you guys. So we've got the Adidas Crazy Boost You Wear. These are light. These are a lot lighter than I thought they were gonna be. That's awesome, that's always good to know. I'm all about these joints. I love it when sneaker brands push the boundaries and drop new models like this right here. This is totally different than anything else that's out there right now, so major props to Adidas for being bold and dropping an aggressive silhouette like this and including Boost on there, man. I needed these like yesterday. Look at the shape of this sneaker, how aggressive it is down towards the toe box. A bunch of different materials on here as well. So if you go ahead and grab a pair of these, they fit. TTS. I really dig the white piping on the upper as well. These are going to go perfect with a pair of pants that I'm going to show you guys later on in this video that also has that white piping on it. I got a lot to show you guys so I can't spend too much time on these but definitely a fire sneaker. Nice job by Adidas. There's a few other colorways and I'm sure there's going to be a lot of other drops on this model so well done Adidas. Okay so sticking with Adidas we've got the TNT tape windbreaker jacket in forest green and white. So Adidas had a sale a few weeks ago and I was able to get this thing for 40% off or close to it, a price that I was not upset about paying. So I went ahead and grabbed it. I've been eyeing this for so long. I went to an Adidas EQT concert in Chicago and a lot of people were wearing this jacket and I was like, I need to make sure I go ahead and get that at some point before spring. So this was perfect timing. This is super lightweight. In pictures, I was like, that might be like a heavy duty windbreaker. No, it's very lightweight, so perfect for that transitional time from spring into summer. Obviously, you've got the trefoil logo on the side that stands out a lot. You also have it on the back of the collar. So, very cool jacket. They had it in navy and black as well, but this one stuck out to me the most. You're gonna see me picking up a lot of windbreakers this spring, so it's nice to start off that with this joint. So, you gotta practice what you preach, right? And I've been telling you guys that now is the perfect time to buy a new top coat. They're on sale everywhere for over 50% off. You can wear them for another month, maybe two, then stash them away and break them back out in the fall. This particular one is from The Gap and the design is what got me. It retailed for like $250. I ended up getting it for $80. It's a nice mature look as you can see. It's got like this tweed like material, but throughout it there's a plaid design. It's gray, white, and black. A really nice material. I saw this online and I wasn't sure how it was going to look, you know, because things tend to look a little different online than they do in person. I went ahead and got it and I'm so happy that I did. If you've been thinking about getting a top coat or an overcoat or a pea coat or something like that, don't slack, man. Definitely go ahead and grab one. Barney's is actually having a crazy 70% off sale, Barney's Warehouse, and there's a ton of top coats on there. So I'll link that sale down below where you can get designer top coats for 70% off. Well worth it. This one just happened to be from The Gap because, you know, I like The Gap. 
A lot of people don't. I have no shame shopping at The Gap. The past couple of years, they've really been turning things around and you can get some great styles from The Gap. So if you missed my video yesterday, I also went ahead and grabbed the Black Cement 3s with the Nike Air on the back. Went to my local mall, grabbed a pair. Let me know if you went ahead and grabbed a pair or did you sleep? Because I was kind of on the fence. I was like, I got my older pair. I don't know if I need these or not. But man, yes. I did need these and I'm so happy that I shelled out the 200 bucks for them because it's well worth it and this will be a sneaker that's in my rotation for a minute. If you missed that on feet how to style video, go check it out. And this year is going to be a crazy one for sneaker releases. Adidas stepping it up with new Yeezys and new models. Jordan is going to be retroing a bunch of good stuff as well. So it's definitely a good time to be into sneakers. I'm interested to see which brand comes out on top at the end of this year. Next up, I got a quick pickup from Stussy, and this one just showed up. It's a very simple and straightforward long sleeve t-shirt, but I needed this in my closet. I didn't have it, so I went ahead and grabbed it off Urban Outfitters. It is the classic black and white Stussy logo on the back of a long sleeve t-shirt on the front. Same logo on the left side. And this logo is just iconic in the streetwear world. If you didn't know, Stussy makes great quality t-shirts and long sleeve tees are perfect for that transition time that I was just talking about from spring to summer. So I'm gonna fold this joint up and hopefully break it out within a month or so. But Stussy, long sleeve black tee, a must. All right, next up, I got something from Top Man. These are a pair of track pants and I just got these off Nordstrom. And this style pant is perfect for the upcoming weather. Oh my God, I hate them. Nordstrom, I hate you. Why did you have to do this to me? <laughs> they left the security tag on the bottom of the ankle of these pants. Damn, is this gonna damage the goods if I try to rip this off? Have you ever had a security tag like this from Nordstrom left on your pants? Am I just ripping this off right now? There's not going to be any ink flying out, right? Nah, this isn't that tight. Come on, man. It's a pair of $25 pants. That's what I paid for these, right? I paid $29.99. Retail was $50. So, come on, man. Did me dirty. I'm lying to you guys. I shoplifted the shit out of these joints. Just left with them. Went into the changing room, threw them on. And then uh, I put my baggy Wrangler jeans over them and I just left, bro. Straight jacked these $29.99 pants. Whoo, feeling good about myself. So these are the pants I was saying are gonna go well with the Boost You Wear sneakers. Both of them have that white piping as just a small detail. I think it's gonna be a good combination. I may actually wear the security tag on the side, just try to start a new trend, like an ankle monitor or something like that. SMH bro. But getting into my last pickup, I've got something from Supreme that is so fire. I needed this joint and I struck out on it when it dropped in the fall. This is a, I think it was the fall. I'm, I'm trying to remember when exactly this dropped. It dropped at the same time as the box logo hoodies, but this is the quarter zip velour jacket in black and red. This is so right up my alley. And I was upset because I was able to cart this in like other colors, but I wasn't able to check out because everybody was on there trying to get a box logo hoodie. I didn't even care about the box logo. Like forget that. This joint is so clean. It's got red Supreme embroidery on the front, just tonal to match that red panel. I had been eyeing this jacket on eBay for a while now and there was a bunch that were right around the retail price but I was stubborn about not paying over retail so I waited it out and I was eventually able to get it for retail with free shipping so I kind of saved 10 bucks or 12 bucks whatever shipping is not everything from Supreme has to be this crazy color or have this all over print there are some subtle gems on there just like this and again a perfect jacket to transition from spring 
into summer. I'll be putting out a lot of content about that in the next few weeks when it starts to warm up. So keep an eye out for that one. I'm going to end the video here. So definitely hit the thumbs up if you enjoyed this clothing haul. Leave a comment. Let me know if there's anything that you've been picking up that you want to put me on to because I'm always open to checking out new brands. Someone like DM me the other day and put me on to this new brand out in Canada that I had no idea about and I ordered something. You guys know my style. If there's any good brands out there you think I would like, leave a comment down below so I can check those out. Make sure you're following me on Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat, all Eddie Wynn Kicks. A lot of new videos on the way. I'll talk to you guys soon. Peace.